Hi, welcome back to Therapy Designs. If you're new to this channel, my name is Kelly, and this channel is all about teaching you how to create print on demand designs that sell. And if you stay tuned till the end of the video, I have five bonus niches for you guys that you guys can be working on right now. So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to use another cool new um, Canva app. And I'm going to show you guys how you can sell um, customized uh, dog photo. I guess it doesn't have to be a dog photo, but just custom photo like um, uh, display plates, I guess is what you would call this. This is a display plate from uh, Print KK. So I'm going to show you guys how you can create this product right here. Um, and so the first thing we're going to do is I'm just going to go ahead and go over to my uh, homepage on Canva here. So I'm going to go Canva home. And from here, we're just going to go ahead and start with a custom size. Um, now, because I am designing this for a plate, um, it's going to be a circle. So I'm just going to use a square format. But um, depending on what you're doing, obviously, you can pick the sizes you want. So for a square, I'm just going to go ahead and go with 4,000 by 4,000 pixels. And I'll make sure the quality is nice and good and hit create a new design. And so what we would do is we would start with a photo. So let's say you were selling these custom photo, um, well, you can do this with any product, but I'm going to show you with the plate, custom photo plates. So somebody would uh, buy, the, buy the plate or message you first and send you the photo. Um, and so you would upload the photo here onto your uploads. But for example, for today, I'm just going to go ahead and use um, the, the elements here. So I'm just going to go ahead and search for dog photo. So dog, and we'll go through the photos doesn't matter which one. Let's just say I'm going to show you the example that I had used. I think this is the example that I had originally showed, but uh, it doesn't matter. Somebody sends you a photo of their dog. So there's the photo they sent you of their dog. Looks nice, cute little dog photo. What we're going to do is we are going to turn this into more of a painting. And so the app that we're going to use is one that is called um, Paintify. And so you'll start with your photo. And then what we're going to do is go ahead and scroll down to apps. And from here, again, there's zillions of apps that you can look through, a whole bunch of them. Some you pay for, some are free. Um, some give you free credits. You'll have to play with all of them. They all kind of have their own pros and cons. Um, if you know the one that you want, of course, you can search for it. If not, you can start browsing and playing with these. And I recommend, you know, taking your time and playing with different ones to see what you like. But for this particular one, I'm going to do one that's called Paint, Paintify. So I can just go ahead and search for it. And so here it is, Paintify. Now, this is one that will give you credits. So it says use one of three credits. So you're allowed three credits per day. Um, this is a great way to test something to see if it works prior to actually subscribing. So let's say I'm thinking about doing this put it up on your Etsy shop, see if you get orders. If you do, and it looks like it's starting to sell, then it's worth subscribing to the Paintify. If not, or if you don't get more than three orders a day, then it's perfect, then you can use it for free. So pretty much it's going to pull up whatever photo you have here and it'll pull it up there and you can hit Paintify and replace, and you can play with what you know strength you're going to want it at. It's set at about 0.5, which is where I left it. So I can hit Paintify and replace, and it is going to essentially turn this photo into a painting. And so there you go. It created a painting out of the photo. So I can go ahead and hit Add to Design, and here we go. So now I've got uh, this. So I can add a page so that I can see it kind of separately here and we can blow it up. And so there it is. Looks pretty cool, right? And you can blow it up, crop it however you want. It's going to be in a plate. So maybe center the face there. And that looks pretty cool. So we started with the photo of the dog and now we've got sort of the painting style of the dog. And so from here, I'm just gonna go ahead and download this. I'm gonna say dog painting, and we'll go ahead and just download page two. So I don't need a transparent background because it's covering the whole background. So all I have to do is go ahead and download page two and hit download. 
And then what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and jump over to print KK. Now I'm using print KK for this example, just because I want to do the plate, but you can use, you know, that on any of the print platforms that you like. The three that I use personally with my Etsy shop are print KK, printful and printify. And depending on the product I'll use, you know, different ones. So I use all three because all three of them have different products or different price points. And so there's, you know, ones that I use like Printful for hats because I like the embroidery. I use Printify for like the socks because I like the socks on there. Print KK I use, I really like the kind of the button up Hawaiian shirts on here. And as far as I know, it's the only one that has the plates available. Um, let's see if I can go ahead and search here too. So if I put plate, license plate frames those are pretty cool too here we go global shipping for the decorative plate and so that's the one i wanted to show you it is new to um oops, so to print kk so i can go ahead click here right and i can hit start designing there are eight inch plates and 10 inch plates they're ceramic um price is you know just shy of seven bucks plus the shipping so you're looking at 18 dollars for the plate and so that's not bad for a custom plate plus you know whatever you're going to mark it up as so maybe you sell it for 28 29.99 for a custom plate um, and so we're going to go ahead hit start designing and then what you're going to do is you're going to go ahead go over to your upload section it'll pull up your downloads and you can upload that down dog painting that you just got so now right here i gave you recommended pixels of what 1400 roughly and we did 4000 so we definitely are way above the recommended pixels so quality should be pretty good so we can go ahead and just click on that and there we have what will look like our custom plate here and so you can see the way that that would look and it comes with a little stand and everything too and some nice mock-up images and so we can just go ahead then and hit save and perfect and so now it would be on my designs and you can go ahead and upload that to your shop um so anyways i know that was kind of quick there's a lot more obviously to uploading it to to etsy and everything else that would be like a whole nother video there but essentially you get the order somebody sends you the picture you do the paintify effect um, you can go and you can edit your orders um and once you've edited the order and put in you know their photo then you can have it you know obviously made and shipped out to them so it's a cool way to offer um you know custom photo products and because this is a new product and one i haven't seen on um the other platforms the other more common platforms right now this would be pretty low competition i don't know that there's a lot of other people doing print on demand plates so i think this one has a good opportunity of taking off so just keep it in mind but it's really the app that i wanted to show you guys if you have any questions about this drop it in the comment section below i try to get back to everybody as quickly as i can um i do have a link below this video so you guys can get a free list of um evergreen niches and seasonal niches there's over 100 on each list so you're looking at over 200 different niches that you guys can be working on so especially if you're new and struggling to come up with niches that is a great way to go and it's totally free for you guys to download and because you guys were so patient and waited until the end of the video i do again have that list of five bonus niches for you so as promised these are going to be your five bonus niches and because spring break is coming up i went ahead and selected five spring break bonus niches that you guys can be working on now so number one, and this is great every year, just says spring break, Florida, 2025. And this is scalable tremendously, obviously, because every year you can scale it to put the year, but also because of location. So you can scale it to put different locations too. So it says spring break, Florida, it could say spring break, California, spring break, San Diego, and then include the year or not include the year. So lots of different ways you can go about that. Number two, bra, it's spring break. Why? Because bra is still very popular. Number three, what's up beaches? Because everybody likes to go to nice beaches for spring break. 
Um, number four, spring break squad. The squad and the crew shirts are always great because we get those matching group shirts and then people do orders of obviously more than one shirt because it's a group. So you could get five orders or six orders or however many people are in the group. So group shirts, always great. And then number five, spring break drinking team. And again, that could also be a group shirt. So and of course, those college kids love to go and party on the beach for spring break. So lots of fun things you can start thinking about now. Um, if you have any questions, again, put it in the comment section below. I hope you guys are doing really well with your sales. And I do hope to see you guys again. That's it for today's video. If you found that useful and would like to see more videos with helpful tips and tricks, be sure to hit like and subscribe and turn on your notifications so you don't miss any of the weekly videos. As always, keep growing and stay creative. And we'll see you next time.